Taking six, you there? Hesh. Logan. Uh, copy. Yeah, we're here. Go ahead. Reports are coming in. Dallas got overrun last night. Command wants another sweep of the wall ASAP. <sighs> Shit. Any survivors? Negative. Sorry I didn't wake you. Thought you could use a sleep. Quiet boy. Listen. Hey, Riley's got something. Grab a gear, let's move. Team two, are you near our position? Negative, we're outside. Your boy's got something. Riley does. We're checking it now. Raj, we'll secure the exit. Two one out. Getting hungry. If you don't want to eat anything out here, boy, let's head back and get you some real food. Six one, zip red. Just some local wildlife. We're good. Check. We're moving up to RP Silver. Copy. Yeah, we'll ah. join you. Ah. Meet us at the wall. We're on our way out. Rush. There she is. Looking like hell. Still standing. Yo, Sergeant. Your area secure? Just about. We need to sweep this side of the wall and we're good. We'll take the left side. Should go quick. Regroup at the gas station. You got it. They're executing civvies. Move in, move in! Riley, go!
We're clear! Corporal Davis, you're on transport. Roger, commandeering for transport. Logan, you're on security in the back. Let's go find the old man. Dad! I heard about the attack. You boys okay? Always. Walk with me. Dad, they're executing civilians. I know. Their recon teams round up scavengers, drifters, hoping to find a way into the city. It's how they took Dallas practically overnight. So how can we help? Dad. Listen, you boys. You're the only thing I've got left in this world. Dad, listen. But you're also the only ones I can trust. Hey, look. Whatever it is, Logan and I, we're ready. You two are going to no man's land. Wait, for real? We've been on the defensive for far too long, so I'm sending you outside the wall. You'll link up with a recon team, gather any intel you can on the enemy, and get your asses back here. So where in no man's land are we going? Somewhere you know better than anyone. You're going home. We call it No Man's Land. A span of destruction between LA and San Diego, created when Odin was turned against us. The beaches and surf breaks of my own childhood were now mined and abandoned. Dad told us few men got to operate in no man's land. It was too dangerous. Too unpredictable. If he was sending us out there, it must have been important to him. Still, I couldn't help but think this was another one of his tests. A lesson he was trying to teach us.